everyone you are welcome back to prospect channel tv thank you very much for this coming out here please do not forget to hit the like button and also subscribe if you are new here thank you very much once again may god almighty bless you all governor ben ayode a presidential aspirant under the platform of the apc has given his opinion on the argument that nigerian's next president should be of southeast extraction the Cross River State Governor, in a recent interview with Arise News, explained why he decided to join the 2023 presidential race and made the call for the presidency to be zoned to the Southeast region. At 14.03 minutes into the video, which was shared on YouTube, Governor Ayode opined that to put an end to the ghost of the civil war, it is only natural that if all the zones have produced the president, the Southeast should be given a chance. However, Governor Ayode also gave two reasons why he is contesting for the presidency, regardless of his opinion on the Southeast presidency. He said, My availability to contest comes as a civilized way to say, just in case the political structure and the family ultimately does his calculation and it fits into south south i will be available on the base of my experimental credentials made available given what i have done in cross river state number two i also think that the south south has not completed our own term uh, eight years and therefore that leaves us with the opportunity to seek to complete our term. Not that the former president, Gulog Jonathan, the first person from the South South to become president of Nigeria since, since the return of democracy failed to win his second term in 2015. This is why some people from the South South zone urge that in order to balance the political equation of the country, the South South should be allowed to govern Nigeria for another term of four years <laughs> oh my god look at just look at them just look at these people all of them are just deceiving themselves everybody want to rule nigeria even when you cannot boldly show what you have done in your own state you want to become nigerian president all of them are jumping out they want to become nigerian president this will not make Nigerians to understand that our politicians are just there for their selfish interests, not for the benefit of the masses. Because how can people who could not even boldly, you know, tell Nigerians what they have done in their own state are coming out to be Nigerian president? This is, this is how it, uh, it shows that Nigerian government did not try. This Nigerian government, this administration, did not try. For everybody to be coming out, they want to contest. They want to be president. Because they don't see, say, people when they there, they not do more than, you know, more than them. Hmm. Anyway, guys, let's quickly get straight to the comment section. Someone said, look at this dove. This dove. With his useless head, a thief who cannot pay elderly old widows sweeping the streets. This man called Ayode is the real Judas of our time. Just hear what he is saying. He talks like dog at a uh, drug addict. God Almighty, please, my heavenly father, deliver Nigerians from the hands of these criminals in Jesus' name. He said, Amen. Thank you, brother. Please, next time. Don't pray God to deliver, but to divide Nigeria. Look at the insult coming from this governor. So, so may not see it as insult, but it is, is a real insult. My beloved brother, <laughs> don't mind this infidel. Okay? Do not allow this to worry you. The devil is ruling Nigeria and its demons are working very hard to maintain. Are you there? So, if you win, you are going to complete the eight years and step down 
or are you going to cross the eight years good or yes sense no need to blame any any of these so-called apc aspirants Buari is the one to be blamed for lowering the standards and asking all all kind of people to contest god bless you i hate it when people fail to see the simple fact that Buari is to be blamed for all this directly and indirectly those pushing for jonathan presidency under apc know Buari better than any other person they know his weakness they know it is all about him otherwise how on earth could anyone even raise that idea before buhari Ubari led jonathan campaign for office with tunubu amechi and others stand and campaign for the candidates of their party <laughs> i thought professorship is a level where one think where your day you are a disappointment to hold eastern region what is south south and southeast divide and rule hmm. is for fresh in your score be delivered in jesus name are your days correct oh, we complete it this time whether pdp or apc likes it so presidential experience are uh, and dummies okay your brain does not remain remind you to challenge Buhari's election based on the point you are raising now it is now that it is the southeast turn that you remember how many years you have ruled oh boy to be president of this country they hungry you you just they yearn anyhow anyhow you go you not go see hmm? even for dream safe yeah, yeah, they follow you. Wari has shown gullible Nigerians it matters where president comes from. Okay, guys, these are some reactions by Nigerians. What's your take? Kindly share your thoughts with us below the comment section. Thank you very much for this coming out here. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.